Welcome back to Rise 360. There's a new show coming to the airwaves that you are, are going to love. Because I'm obsessed with all these food shows that are out right now. So we have to tell them about what's coming out. Absolutely. We are joined by the splendiferous Nilifah Hadayat. Nilifah, how yes. are you? Oh my God, what an intro. <laughs> yes. I've now got to make sure the show lives up to yes. this energy. Uh, well, so it will. <laughs> look at you. Yes. Come on. Excuse we have sweet. no doubt that it will. Yeah, so I'm can excited I, can about I, can I sell, sell you the elevator version of yes. the pitch? You the elevator pitch for the yes. show. Okay. So, food exposed with Nella for his Sold. Diet. Yes. That's all. <laughs> that was not difficult. But I no. wish you were my commissioner. Oh my goodness. But you're not months. going around just tasting food. Tell us more about how you're delving into the food industry. Yes. So, we went to 16 countries in almost every part of the earth, from the North Pole through to Argentina, wow. to Uganda. We went to West Africa. I went to the high seas. I went to mountaintops because I want to find out where the food that I put in my body comes from. Yeah. What does it cost the people that are making it? What does it cost the planet that has to sustain us and support us? And in the end, what exactly are we being sold? Mm. Um, and a lot of the time you buy stuff, whether it's produce in, in, in the supermarkets or whether it's, you know, I like my fast food, whatever it might be in restaurants, <laughs> this amazing array of food is put in front of you and yet you've got no idea where it's yeah. come from. Mm. So I was... A year ago, I was like, if I'm as fascinated by this as, as I am, where I do my job, my day job, and then I go home and I'm like Googling away like a little mm -hmm. beaver, I was like, hey, listen, maybe my audience want to see something yeah. like this too. Mm. And so, Food Exposed were born. So, my question now is, what sets your food show apart? Because we've seen other people do it before. We've seen them expose McDonald's and show us, you know, burgers in a museum mm -hmm. that have lasted 30 years. So, what sets your show apart? I go there. I mean, I went, I met my wonderful, wonderful friend for life, Winnie, out in Uganda, in trying to farm an acre of land and send her two kids to school whilst she lives in almost squalid conditions in a wow. one-bedroom flat. And I cooked with her, I sat and I ate with her. I went to the North Pole to see where exactly where our last hope, if everything goes wrong, where is humanity's plan B? Where do wow. we store all our seeds? And my point with Food Exposed is, the corporations, the companies, the politicians, that's one thing we can do from our offices, from our desktops as journalists. Then there's the people. Mm -hmm. the, and that's what I care about. That's what I'm passionate about. I want to meet my farmers. I want to meet my producers. And I want to know what effect my choices with what I eat have on their lives mm -hmm. and vice versa. These are the people that produce for us. They mm -hmm. nourish us. Yeah. And yet we in the West do so much to harm and exploit. Mm -hmm. So it's basically a journey that looks at society, communities, humanity through food. That's wow. amazing. So then if that's the case, do you think there's a such thing as clean eating? Mm. I am not a massive fan of clean eating. Mm. I don't know what it means. <laughs> Without all the pesticides and you know, I mean, the real well, organic type of stuff. Is that what it means yes. though? Because it's so, I feel That's like I mean. it's just so confused now. Right. That's you know? my thing, right? Mm -hmm. So you go on Instagram and you follow someone who's like a Facebook or Instagram influencer and you're like, oh my God, I absolutely have to be Deliciously Ella. I'm just going to eat like Deliciously Ella. A, it's boring. <laughs> you know, who wants to eat that much kale? I don't. Yeah. Thank you. Know? you. Um, Someone's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I want my nice burger and chips. Yes. But at the same time, I think my problem is, is a lot of the time decisions are being made in our names as uh -huh. consumers. I need to know more. I need to see this show. Where can people see this show? This is going to is... be on Fusion Television, yes. Fusion.tv, available from the 27th of this month. And I'll be online, on social media, Thank everywhere else. Thank you so else. much. Amazing. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks, Nilifah. It's my pleasure. <laughs>